Have you ever wondered how important deception is in warfare? How it can tip the scales of victory? Deception, particularly the art of camouflage, plays a pivotal role in conflict. It's a game of hide and seek on a grand scale where soldiers disguise themselves to evade the enemy or seize the element of surprise. These tactics of deception have been employed throughout history, but it was during the First World War that things got really creative in terms of camouflage. World War I saw the birth of many unique and innovative camouflage techniques. The French army in particular embraced these new methods of deception with an almost artistic enthusiasm. Their creative approach to camouflage ranged from the simple to the elaborate, and their tactics were as diverse as they were ingenious. One such example involved the painting of white horses. In an effort to make these animals less conspicuous on the battlefield, they were dyed brown using food coloring. This tactic, although effective, did lead to some unexpected challenges. Take, for instance, the time when a freshly dyed horse returned to his corral, only to be attacked by his own herd who failed to recognize him. While the horse emerged victorious from the ensuing brawl, most of his new paint job didn't. But perhaps the most creative of all the French army's camouflage techniques was the installation of fake trees. These were not just any trees, but carefully crafted replicas designed to replace real trees that had been destroyed near the trenches. The process was painstaking, involving detailed study, photography, and the creation of a hollow steel replica in a workshop far from the front lines. A soldier would then climb into the tree via a ladder bolted to the interior of the steel tube, transforming it into a secret observation post. These observation posts were surprisingly successful and none were detected by the enemy. The use of camouflage in World War I set a precedent for future warfare. This ingenious combination of art and military strategy born out of necessity significantly influenced subsequent conflicts and military tactics. The First World War was a catalyst for innovation and creativity in the field of military deception, and the tactics developed during this time have had a lasting impact. Following the First World War, camouflage techniques continued to evolve and advance. In World War II, for example, military strategists took a leaf out of their predecessor's book, employing an array of camouflage techniques on a much larger scale. Entire factories, airfields, and even towns were disguised to confuse enemy reconnaissance. The concept of the Ghost Army, a tactical deception unit, was another innovative strategy that emerged during World War II. This unit used inflatable tanks, sound trucks, and fake radio transmissions to create an illusion of a much larger force, thereby deceiving the enemy about their strength and location. In the modern era, the use of camouflage has become even more sophisticated. Digital camouflage, for instance, is designed to disrupt the human eye's perception and the visual rendering by digital devices. Stealth technology, another modern marvel, reduces the detection of aircraft, ships and missiles, making them virtually invisible to radar. The importance of deception in warfare cannot be overstated. It's not just about hiding or blending into the environment. It's about manipulating the enemy's perception of reality. Deception can create doubt, confusion and misdirection which can be exploited to gain a strategic advantage. As warfare continues to evolve with advancements in technology and strategy, so too does the art of camouflage. Today, it's not just about physical concealment, but also about digital and electronic deception. Cyber warfare has introduced a whole new dimension of camouflage, where the battle is not just on the ground, sea or air, but also in the virtual world. Camouflage, a simple yet effective deception technique, continues to play a crucial role in warfare, constantly evolving with the changing times. As we look to the future, the evolution of camouflage and deception in warfare is set to continue, adapting to new technologies and strategies. The advent of cyber warfare has seen the art of deception move into the digital realm. Hackers use deceptive techniques to infiltrate networks, steal sensitive information, and disrupt systems. They employ tactics such as phishing, spoofing, and the use of malware to deceive and exploit their targets. Digital camouflage is also increasingly being used in the world of surveillance and counterintelligence. Facial recognition technology, for example, can be fooled by certain patterns and designs, making it a new front line in the battle of deception. In the future, we can expect to see an increase in the use of digital camouflage as the line between the physical and digital worlds continues to blur. 
As technology evolves, the art of deception will continue to innovate, pushing the boundaries of what we thought possible. From the trenches of World War I to the digital battlegrounds of the future, the art of camouflage and deception remains a vital component of warfare strategy. In the end, it's not just about blending into the background or hiding in plain sight, it's about manipulating perception, creating confusion and gaining the upper hand. The future of warfare may be uncertain, but one thing is for sure. The art of deception in all its forms will continue to play a crucial role. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about history, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.